Inexplicably, Arthur takes no notice of the towel, which magnificently you are trying to return to him. Instead, he says, Ford, what about my home? You start guiltily. Does he actually know that the earth is about to be destroyed? You start to ask him, then stop. If he knows, what the zark is he doing lying here in the mud in front of? You look around. You notice the bulldozer properly for the first time. You notice Arthur's house. You notice the workman. The penny drops. His house is about to be demolished. You feel like a complete... What's the word? You are listening to Video Gamers Oasis Playful Podcast. And this is Text Adventure Tuesdays. We are playing The Hitchhiker's Guide to the Galaxy. Interactive fiction. Text adventure game. First released in 1984. And we're playing this on Winfrots. Video Gamers Oasis, playful podcast. Discussions on my favorite games, movies, TV shows, anime, comic books, collectibles, and other fun content for gamers and geeks. I'm your host, Jeremy. Welcome to the show. You are listening to Video Gamers Oasis Playful Podcast, and this is Text Adventure Tuesdays. We are playing The Hitchhiker's Guide to the Galaxy, interactive fiction, text adventure game, first released in 1984, and we're playing this on Winfrots. All right. So we are, we are in the country lane. We're at the country lane, and uh, this is uh, this is the alternate reality. Uh, you're in on Earth, back on Earth as Ford. So what we need to do is A, a, a road runs from north, um, Arthur's home to the north. So we need to go north, go north, go north, front of house. Before you is the house of your friend, Arthur Dent, who is lying in front of a bulldozer. You have no idea why. You have no idea about most things about Arthur, even why you regard him as a friend. But you do and must therefore return his towel before you leave. Nearby stands an impatient man. There seems to be a bit of an atmosphere. Open satchel. Opening the satchel reveals Sangtragonian mineral water, water, a towel, a hitchhiker's guide, an electronic sub ether signaling device, and a sa and satchel fluff. Take fluff. Taken. Take towel. Taken. Take device. Taken. Give towel to Arthur. Inexplicably, Arthur takes no notice of the towel, which magnificently you are trying to return to him. Instead, he says, Ford, what about my home? You start guiltily. Does he actually know that the earth is about to be destroyed? You start to ask him, then stop. If he knows, what the zark is he doing lying here in the mud in front of. You look around. You notice the bulldozer properly for the first time. 
You notice Arthur's house. You notice the workman. The penny drops. His house is about to be demolished. You feel like a complete... What's the word? Save our progress as Earth as Ford. Please consult your manual for the correct way to talk to characters. Go to Prosser and ask him to lie down. Look at Prosser. Mr. Prosser from the local council is standing on the other side of the bulldozer. He seems to be wearing a digital watch. Tell Prosser to lay down. Tell Prosser to lay down. Prosser can't hear you from here. Talk to Prosser. Prosser can't hear you from here. Go to Prosser. Go to Pros Prosser. You walk around the bulldozer. Prosser is standing here, looking cross and frustrated. Realizing that you are a friend of Arthur's, he starts to talk, to you, talk at you. He says that this sort of protest is all very well. What Mr. Dent must realize is that he's had plenty of time to make a formal protest at the proper time and place, and that spending months going through the appropriate official channels, filling in the appropriate official forms, and going to the appropriate official public hearings is the right way of going about it and lying around whimsically in the mud is not. He says that he personally hates mud and despises the sort of people who lie in it. Tell Prosser to lie down. I don't understand, what are you referring to? Talk to Prosser. Hmm, Mr. Prosser looks at you expectantly as if you seem to be about to talk. Tell Prosser to lie down. Lay down. I don't understand what you're referring to. Inventory. You have an electronic sub a towel. Okay, give, give towel to Arthur. Politely, Arthur Dent refuses your, off your offer. Uh, um, talk, talk to uh, Prosser. Hmm, Mr. Prosser looks at you expectantly as if you seem to be about to talk. How do you talk again? Ask Prosser to lay down, lie down. Ask Prosser to lie down. Prosser blinks in astonishment. You mean go and lie in the mud in his place? You explain that Arthur will only move if someone else takes over for him. Prosser shakes his head in such a manner as to suggest that he is very weary of the world and you actually forbear from mentioning that it won't be troubling him much longer. Reluctantly, he follows you back toward Arthur. Arthur. You rapidly conclude the business. Prosser lies in the mud. Arthur, bewildered, nevertheless stands up and appears ready to follow you to the pub. You are listening to Video Gamers Oasis Playful Podcast. And this is Text Adventure Tuesdays. We are playing The Hitchhiker's Guide to the Galaxy. Interactive fiction. Text adventure game. First released in 1984. And we're playing this on Win Frots. Video Gamers Oasis Website YouTube Channel